Beggars can't be choosers, but beggars never quit. Height here, and you already know what this is. It's time for choosing beggars. Let's do it. Our first one is from I Destroy Cat. Looking for a babysitter from February 21st to March 2nd. Blink and I are going to Aruba and need someone to watch the kids. We'll pay a good $250 to $300 for the week. Mama needs a vacation bad. Mama should take out of that vacation fund and pay somebody a little bit more if they want that round the clock care for the week. This next one is by Hardly Broken One. Does anyone know of someone that has a mini mill dashund that is approved breeder and healthy too? Thanks for any feedback. They don't mention if they want it for free, but considering they want the dog for breeding, you can guarantee free is on their list. This next one is from Supreme King Yetus. I'm currently looking for a babysitter for my two month old daughter. Pay us every two weeks minimum wage. Requirements are have a valid license with transportation, must have CPR certification, must be great with kids, must have common sense, work on time, Monday to Friday, times are morning to evening to 7 p.m., no criminal records, no tattoos, no drugs, no smoking or drinking, must know how to cook. It's bad enough they're only paying minimum wage. They don't even list the morning start time, probably because it's a ridiculous time, and I just fail to see how tattoos would affect the care given to a child. This next one is by Your Connect. If this roast turn out good, I'll bring you a small pan, but you have to make your own side dishes. It's cooking overnight. I'll let you know in the AM when I'ma drop it off. Okay, let me know what sides you making. <laughs> What did I literally just say? You make your own sides. Be grateful for the roast, brat. I mean, the first message was clear as day where they were telling the beggar they had to make their own sides. I love how the beggar tried to pull a fast one and still was denied. This next one is from Janetti Bobetti. Looking to buy a vehicle for $1,500 to $2,000 max. Don't need anything fancy, but six to eight seats for the fam. No mechanical issues and working AC would be great. Thank you. Apparently this beggar is unaware that used car prices are still up there and they're probably not going to find something for that price range. This next one is by Fran1114. I hate making this post, but we need some items. I've been struggling to keep up and we need a few things to get us through till my mom's check drops on Friday. Our accounts are both negative, so buying is out of picture and mom can't work with me in this heat, so we need some help. We need currently Dawn Power Spray Refill Lemon Scent Preferred, but any works. TP Quilt Northern, as this brand doesn't cause rashes for my mom and I. Some frozen meals, chicken pot pie, spaghetti with meat sauce, or pizza rolls, pepperoni or combo. Coke a cola, preferred canned, but bottle is okay. Hand soaps, or even refill to refill the ones we have. Always discreet briefs that my mom needs. She needs size large. Some hair ties as I have none and my current one's nearly about to break. Please don't judge us. I've been working as much as we can but this heat's taking too much on both of us. Need drop off as she won't drive in this heat. Off Begton and Begsville in a hotel. Thank you. We don't have much gas to get to pantries. I feel like if you're in a situation like this, you don't really have a right to be picky in any way, shape, or form, especially if you're asking for free things and asking for those things to be delivered. But then again, that's just how I think, but I think a lot of people feel the same. This next one is by Fuck You Fucking Sharks. Super stretch, but anyone giving away a queen mattress and a smart TV? I have a 32 inch TV. It's not a smart TV, but it has the input for Amazon Fire Stick. Yeah, I have one of those already. <laughs> grateful. I'm confused what they're grateful for. Already having the TV or trying to get a second of one they already have. 
This next one is from Kuxio. $70, a full-size futon with cover. Hello, is this still available? Would you consider giving it to me for free, and could you please bring it to my home? I don't have any transportation to come get it. I live in Begton on Begville. My husband has cancer, and my daughter is sleeping on the floor. Anytime somebody says they, a family member, or a friend has cancer, I feel bad, but then I remember, if it's coming from a choosing beggar, you don't know how honest they're really being. This next one is by Sale Hayton 2. Hey guys, I'm in need for a co-signer for a car. I'm still young, so that's why it was not approved. If anyone needs quick cash and are able to co-sign for me, that would be great. I would offer $500 up front for it. I could discuss details further if anyone could do me the favor. You are better off asking for someone's kidney. That's a lot of liability you're asking of people, to be honest. Do you know what the point of a cosigner is? Just in case you don't know, if you fuck up or miss a payment, etc., they go to the cosigner to cover it. That's a whole lot of risk for someone to cosign for you. The fact that you can't have... I can't help but wonder if they're literally trying to offer somebody $500 so they could get a cosigner and then never make a payment again, keep the car, and put the debt onto the cosigner. You just never know. But then again, if they are in fact young, they might just not know better. And our final one is by Spammera Tormen. Hi, I'm posting this for myself. As a mother of three kids and one stepson, and of course married, I'm in need of meats like ground beef, pork chops, chicken, ribs, steak, some encore meals, etc. Things for breakfast as in ground pork sausage, bacon, sausage links, corned beef hash in a can, hash brown patties, and shredded hash browns, etc. Things for drinks, Gatorade, tea, sweet, juice, water, crystal light packets, soda, cola, Sprite, ginger ale, Mountain Dew, grape, orange, Pepsi. I would get this myself and everything, but I can't drive because of my disabilities. Also on Saturday, on the way to Milwaukee County Zoo. We were in a car accident. Everyone is okay, but just sore, sleepy, and exhausted. Can anyone help me out, please? I guess I'm confused. They say they would get them themselves, but they can't drive. I get that bit, but why don't they have like a grocery store or a delivery service deliver those things to them? Something tells me at the end of the day, they can't afford it. That's why. And if that is the case, they should just be honest about it. All right, that's enough beggars for the day. Well, that wraps up this episode of Choosing Beggars. If you liked the video, please drop a like, share my content on all of your social media, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to hit that bell so you're notified every time I upload, and drop a comment down below. It really helps with the algorithm and helps new people find my channel. Thanks for watching, thanks to my patrons and super thanks contributors. Have a great day and stay safe out there.